We're seeing P1 today. You guys know the drill, okay? We're gonna get ready and I just woke up. Oh my God, I look like a disaster. I'm gonna do my makeup. I still have zero, okay, zero idea what I'm gonna wear. Um, for some reason, I was really struggling with this concert. I I had an outfit that I was gonna wear for their first date, but since they postponed, the more I looked at that outfit, I was like, mm, I don't like it. So I ended up returning that outfit. It was like a denim dress. It just didn't flatter. It didn't look flattering on my body. So I was like, yeah, I'm not gonna wear that. I tried going to thrift stores to see if I could like find something that I like and like work around it but i couldn't find anything so i was like i'll just see what i have in my closet make something up and we'll just go from there and honestly i shouldn't even be spending money because first of all i have hella clothes second of all i need to be saving for all these other concerts that i'm planning to go to i do want to wear purple because i feel like that's like low-key p1 harmony's like color i guess i also did notice a lot of fans wore purple so i feel like it'd be cute to wear purple too we'll see what i have i think fernanda's gonna come here in a bit too and then i'm gonna get ready I'm gonna wait for my sister to get ready and then we're gonna head out. We're probably gonna hang out a little bit over there. Get something to eat, maybe. I do want to see the merch because I heard the merch is, like, really cute. Or, like, I, I think I saw one of the t-shirts and I really like the t-shirts. And I already have the P1 Harmony light stick, so I'm set on that. I think Fernanda still needs to get her light stick. I think she's gonna buy it over there. I'm excited. Honestly, it hasn't hit yet that I'm gonna go see them. I don't know why it feels like I already saw them. I think it's because, you know, I was so hyped to go see them in March. I believe it was in March when it was their first date. And then it got canceled. And I was like, damn. And then, like, I was like, okay. It's been like a few months since March. What the? Oh my god, this is my new concealer. I'm like, why is it not opening? And then, now that I'm seeing them literally today, like, it hasn't hit. I feel like I already saw them. Even though, like, I literally haven't. I think it's because I've been seeing so many, like, P1 Harmony concert videos. It just seems like I was there. <laughs> even though I literally was not. I've been listening to their music for so long. I've been, like, repeating their, like, albums and stuff since I got into them. And so I'm excited to finally see those songs live. I know my sister is over the top excited to go see them. I went with my sister to LA last year when P1 Harmony had their little like performance in, in LA. Ooh, isn't that cool? You like twist it, it comes out. Me and my sister did a little like last minute. Oh my gosh, this is a lot. Of Me and my sister did a last minute um, trip to LA last year to go see P1 Harmony because I really wanted to go see them and at that time we didn't know if P1 was gonna go on tour oh my gosh I just bought this concealer but it looks way too light or maybe it doesn't maybe I just need to blend it out I asked her I was like can we please go and she's like hell yeah she's like it'll be good for like experience and I was like hell yeah because we've never gone to LA on our own like we've only ever gone like with our parents or whatever it was our first time traveling like just us two like that like had a last minute too and for just like a day they didn't perform reset which I believe is her favorite song I'm excited to hear bop scared it's gonna feel surreal because like I said I've literally only listened to them on their on like Spotify and stuff oh my gosh this is so pale isn't it the reason I got this new one is because I felt like the one that i had before was way too like like it didn't have enough coverage but this is hella do i look too pale i don't know let me just add my bb cream hopefully that's this makes it look better i want a slurpee so bad oh my god i heard it's gonna be really hot today and the show is in san jose and i think san jose like in general it like gets very hot sometimes i was planning on wearing a jacket like a statement jacket but not anymore bro i'm gonna be sweating people sometimes ask me like how i keep my skin really clear or like to drop the skincare routine god i treat my skin so badly and i don't have a skincare routine the only thing i use the only thing i do when i take off my makeup i use miscellaneous something like that i use that water i don't use wipes because i heard that's bad and i wipe off my makeup with a little cotton ball i make sure i take off like majority of the makeup off especially like mascara and eyeliner because that's like waterproof so that little water thing removes it very easily and then after that i just use the cerave i don't know that's how you pronounce it cerave a cerave face wash and i use a little like spongy thingy to like exfoliate my face i wash my face and then I dry it and then I put some CeraVe crema. That's all I do. I don't use skincare. I used to, but then like I ran out 
and I got lazy to buy more so I'm excited to finally start using my light sticks the only light sticks I have are P1 Harmony, The Boys, Wavies, and NCTs and I still want to get Twices I do want to get a BTS one I don't know I don't think Ghost 9 has a light stick but whenever they do get one I want to get that one and then I've I don't know if I've has a light stick but if they do get one I want to get one but I'm excited that like all these groups oh I got a new eyebrow pencil too I'm excited to finally start using my light sticks because you know they've just been sitting there collecting dust I'm excited that groups are finally starting to go on tour because today I get to use my P1 Harmony light stick and then for the boys I get to use my light stick and that one's gonna be so fun okay because that their light stick is so nice it's so cute i think i have a pc addiction and i think i've always had one okay but i think it's gotten a bit worse now because mm, ever since i got into ive and like i've been like in love with him i've been collecting a lot of their pcs okay it's crazy does it look good why is Everything looking bad today. Especially if it's gonna be hot today, my ma my makeup's gonna melt off. Oh, I forgot to mention what tickets we have. We got P3, I believe. We're in the balcony and we have, I believe, the hello session. Yeah, that's the only tickets that I managed to get because like everything had sold out. Cause it was only me trying to get the tickets because I think Fernando was working. But yeah, I was surprised that I even got tickets to be honest. Cause I heard they were like selling out. And I was like, oh, I'm glad I was a I was able to get tickets because I did not want to buy resale. I believe I've been slouching this whole time I was recording. I'm so sorry. Every time I'm comfortable, I slouch. Okay, so that means that means we're comfortable with each other. That means I don't care about my posture. I don't know if you guys have seen the K-pop flex thing that happened in Germany. Oh my god, I've never been so jealous in my life. Like, a lot of K-pop artists performed in Germany. Kai was there, um, Mama Moo, NCT Dream, I've... I forgot the other um, K-pop groups, but that was crazy. I, like, that caught me by surprise because I didn't even know that that was, like, a thing. Oh my god. My energy is kind of low today, and I don't know why. I do know that... Oh my gosh, I totally forgot. I'm expecting... To come like today like i got it this date last month and usually i'm pretty on time um sometimes i'm like a day late or something but usually i'm pretty on time okay so if it comes today it's over for me because i hate i hate it maybe that's why i'm feeling a bit down i hope it goes away maybe once i get to the venue then i'll feel like more hyped up also maybe i'm just like hungry because i haven't eaten either I noticed that since I have a crease like right there, like I have hooded eyes, hooded eyelids. Um, every time I put eyeshadow, it makes a crease. Like after a few hours, it's like I don't even have eyeshadow anymore. Like like it literally ha just has a crease of whatever color eyeshadow I used. I love green eyeshadow. I think if I was an eyeshadow color, it would be green. I've been really wanting to go to a movie theater and like go watch a movie. Like, I haven't done that in a while. And I kind of want popcorn and, like, a Slurpee. Oh, my God. I don't know if you guys saw it, but Utah is going to be in a movie, I believe. I don't think it's a TV show. I think it's a movie. And he's going to play, like, a villain or something like that. And I think the pictures were, like, just released. And I was like, oh, my gosh. I might have to go get some Starbucks. Because <clears throat> your girl is not feeling good. Now we need to see what we're going to wear. This is going to take a long time. But I feel like I should probably eat something. Okay, I'm gonna make a smoothie. We're in my ugly kitchen. I'll put a banana. I have this little like cup where it has like a little blender inside. Okay, I have my smoothie. I'm just gonna chill for a bit. It's 11 a.m. We're not leaving until I believe around two. We got plenty of time. I'm gonna just watch some YouTube videos. Hopefully it'll lift up my mood. But yeah, as soon as I finish this, we're gonna get started with deciding what to wear. And hopefully I can pick something cute because 
I might have a breakdown. BRB, enjoy your smoothie. Okay, finish my drink. I love chia seeds, but they get up in your teeth. Before I choose what I'm gonna wear, I'm gonna put batteries on my light stick. Look, the moment of truth. Oh, I'm gonna keep it on the blue wood. I'm also gonna carry cute PCs. Ooh, wait, it depends what I'm wearing though. Cause then I'd wanna like match and stuff. Let me bring out some clothes. First, I do wanna wear these because I haven't worn them enough. The last time I wore them was to a Twice concert and I loved, okay? So I'm gonna try to work around these these are from nasty gal but i realized it's kind of hard to style them low key i wanted to do like a dress moment but i don't really have a lot of dresses and the dresses i have i don't think goes with go with these and i want to do a skirt moment but i feel like i just feel like nothing in my closet's working i was thinking maybe this green skirt this green corduroy skirt that i got from urban it's a cute pleated one Okay, and then I don't know what top though. I recently just got this from a thrift store. I feel like that would be cute. And then with the white boots. Also, this is like really see-through, so I don't know what I'd wear under. And I don't think it'd look good with a tank top. It'd have to be like something lacy and like cute. But I think the little white in here, or like the little cream color goes well with the boots. Maybe the skirt isn't the move, but I feel like I kind of like it. I think since this is flowy, it would have to go with a much tighter skirt. I have this dress too that I got from Urban and I haven't worn it. It's like a cute doll dress and I wanted to wear this with the white boots, but I don't think that's going to look good either because this gives me more like a doll, like maybe with Doc Martens. You know, it gives me that kind of vibe. The shoulder is like this little lacy thing. But it might look good with the boots. I don't know. I, I would have to try it on. But yeah, we have this option too. I don't think I want to wear that other silky top because it's going to be like 80 over there. And I, I get hot really fast. So I'm trying not to wear any sleeve. I'm trying to keep this open, okay? Let the baby armpits heal. No, breathe. I'm trying to wear something breathable where I won't feel too like trapped in, you know? I also have this skirt. I think it's from PacSun, but it's a cute like gingham skirt, which I think would look cute with the white boots, but I just don't know what top. Okay, I think I did something. So this is my inspiration for what I was going for for this concert. I don't know how to describe it, but it's just like funky, a lot of different patterns. I wanted to do this outfit right here this one i realized i didn't have any orange skirts or i just don't have anything in my closet that would replicate that i think i found something but i don't know okay it might look different when i try it on but this is what i came up with my room's a mess but isn't this wouldn't this be cute so that same green skirt and then this is actually a dress it's from unif but i love this design okay like it has little orange it has orange flowers on there and then the straps have beads i know i've heard of people like tucking in their dresses into their skirts you know so to make it a top and i think that that would be cute and i think that kind of goes with the little picture inspiration that i was going for once i put it on it's giving watermelon but that's fine i would also just do this dress alone i feel like if i were to wear this it reminds me it looks like i'm going to like harry styles like i feel like that's this is like it's giving me harry styles what a lot of fans wore to the concert which is not bad but i don't know if i'm trying to go for that or there's also this option the same green skirt this white fuzzy vest that i got from pac sun so it would look like that and then i would wear a white headband on my head to match the white top and the white boots um so this like white and green moment yeah i know i said i wanted to do purple but i just can't <laughs> i can't do purple so it's between those two i don't know which one i'm gonna do yet so let me try these things on and then we'll see okay this is the first fit i think it's cute i actually really like this one um i also have another fuzzy top but that one has sleeves and ooh. It's gonna be a waterfall but this one doesn't have sleeves so it keeps the babies airing out obviously my hair isn't done yet so i think i'm gonna straighten it yeah this is how it looks like but i'm gonna try the other one i'm gonna try this one like it being a top we'll see which one wins but i think this one is hitting close okay this is the next one <laughs> 
I also really like this one, but I think it's just because of the pink and the green. Those are my two favorite colors, so every time I see them together, I just like fall in love. I can't decide which one I like. I didn't think this was gonna work, like making it a top, you know? when it's like literally a dress. I would for sure not wear this lace bra though. Which one do you guys like better? I can't decide. I think I'm gonna ask my sister and Fernanda for which one they like better. I am gonna stick with the green skirt though because I think it's really cute and I haven't worn it out as much. I've only worn it like twice, I think. So yeah, I definitely wanna wear it out more. Okay, let me decide and I'll get back to you guys. I asked my sister and Fernanda which one they thought was better and they, oh, I changed. They said this one. So I'm gonna do this one, except I change into this other shirt because I'm gonna straighten my hair right now. Um, I'm also gonna wear this cute white headband, um, but it's like kind of blue. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see. I was gonna try and wash it with bleach and like dry it really quick, but I think it's fine. It shouldn't be that bad. I'm gonna add more jewelry and rings and stuff and then pick a PC. Fernanda is about to be here in like a few minutes. Guess who's here? Mark. Mark's girlfriend. I just came from our wedding. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I'm gonna carry this Cinema Roll Sanrio PC holder. Isn't it cute? Mm -hmm. I think I'm a. Which one should I do? I'm between that one or that one. Okay, I'm gonna do this PC. Cute. And then I'm gonna take this clear bag which is from my unboxing but it's from nuna secret crafts it's a cute little part a little cinema i'm gonna hang it on here no gosh it's gonna look like this look at this isn't this cute mm. wow wow later on if you have another bias i can make you another one no i'm not talking to you yeah <laughs> Let me see what she made you. Focus, bro. It says Mars. Cause she's an alien. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> We're the bridesmaids. True. This is the, no, this is the groom. Like from each like group. Oh wait, this is the one that spins, right? Poop. She's gonna drive now. And we're gonna get food because I'm hungry. What are we? We're dumb and we didn't get it earlier.
Hey guys, okay, just a little rundown of what happened. Sorry, I didn't vlog that much. It was pretty hectic. There was a lot going on. And as soon as we got there, it was just like, there was a lot of lines and stuff. And a lot of you guys came up to me, and so I didn't really have time to vlog. We went to, to a restaurant, we, we ate food there. And then right after, we went to the venue, which was like a few blocks away. I met a few of my mutuals, like Maya, Pat, and Aaliyah. And it was so fun. I loved meeting everyone. It was very surreal. And just like saying hi to everyone, talking to everyone. It was so nice. It was, it literally warmed my heart, especially because I wasn't feeling good at the beginning of this video. And just like talking to everyone definitely made me feel a lot better. So eventually they started letting people into the venue. Me, my sister Fernanda had to get our wristbands to get our hello session thing for like the end of the concert. They gave us little goodie bags. And I didn't know, I didn't even know we were going to get goodie bags. But they gave us a signed poster and it has all their signatures on there and it's so cute it's like a mini one and then they also gave us a random pc i got june and then fernanda got soul but we traded because june is her bias and then my sister got intact cute and then i also got a bunch of freebies i'm gonna like briefly show you guys the freebies but this is one of the freebies it's like a little keychain a little um pc oh look at this one and then like stickers and little just little goodies they're so cute they also were giving out little candies and like these little candy bags they were also giving up giving out banners mine's like all folded but it's, it's a cute little banner i got so many gifts these are a few of the gifts that i got i'm wearing them um <laughs> oh my god i literally cried okay one of my followers they made me this cute little necklace and it says yamey on it and i started sobbing okay they were literally the sweetest people ever like i got super emotional and they also made me uh, a yamey necklace this one and this one one of my other friends jade made me and i'm wearing it right now okay it's the day after but i'm gonna i'm gonna flex these and then my friend jade also made me a cute collage of Theo. oh it's so cute 
I got another little gift from one of you guys and <laughs> I, this one caught me so off guard. They gave me confetti from Twice, from Twice's concert, which I thought was so cute. I love this. I love this. Thank you so much. They also gave me freebies. Oh, babies. A bunch of stickers and like NCT. Yeah, that was basically it. The show was phenomenal like i think this was hands down one of my favorite shows it was very hype like i was so tired i was sweating i was so sticky like it was it was crazy i was convinced i was gonna lose my voice but i can never lose my voice for some reason it was literally one of the best concerts i've ever been to i hope they come back and i really want to see them the next time when they come back too yeah i was very hype okay i was screaming so loud so was fernanda my sister we were all hyped okay we were all ooh, ooh. it was it was amazing amazing performance and literally everyone that i talked to they got bias right by theo like crazy and i was like yeah literally my sister fernanda they were all like theo and i was like yeah i agree he was he was insane his voice is just amazing especially hearing it live was just like i got super emotional they're all super talented their energy on stage kiho is such a great leader like i just they're all such, so amazing and after the show we had to stay for our hello session the members ended up coming out to take their group pictures with the p1 and p2 i believe and we just had to sit back and wait and then after eventually it was our hello session and then i recorded my hello session yeah and then theo completed my heart and so did kiho and then i waved to the other members and it was so cute it was so cute i loved that whole experience so much i'm so glad that i was able to that we were able to get at least the hello session you know even though we didn't get the fan sign or the group picture but the hello session was like good enough for me like i still felt so happy that i was able to see them up close because our seats were kind of not super far away but they were a bit of a distance you know again thank you to anyone who came up to me and said hi or like wanted a picture it means so much to me and it, it gave me so much serotonin and just the fact that you guys like my content and like a lot of you told me that you guys love to watch my youtube videos and like it makes you happy and it makes your day and i'm so thankful that you guys feel that way and that i'm able to make you guys happy in any way and i just really appreciate the support it was really crazy and i was just like overjoyed like i was filled with happiness seeing you guys come up coming up to me and like talking to me talking about our biases and just like our interests and stuff yeah but that's basically everything that happened i'm trying not to ramble as much because i know i can i tend to ramble a lot. i didn't get a chance to buy merch but i'm planning on getting their merch online yeah i really want to get the t-shirt i wanted to wear it today and like flex that i like got to see them in concert but oh another thing that i didn't realize or that i didn't know i knew that san jose was their last stop and there were so many times where like i thought they were gonna leave like they're like okay this is our last song but then they came out and that happened like three or four times like it happened so many times i don't know how many encores they had for like their other shows but for this one they had so many and i was like oh it was just funny because i was like okay they're leaving like they said bye and then they're like psych and then they just came out and like started singing another song and it was just so funny i'm so happy that i got into them because now I'm able to see them, you know, see them grow and stuff. And yeah, I'm super thankful for everything and everything that you guys gave me and like for saying hi. And I'm just super thankful that I, I got a chance to go see P1 Harmony with my friends and having this like awesome experience. I love going to concerts. It definitely lifted up my spirits because I've been feeling kind of down these past few weeks. And so yeah, going to concerts is like definitely my serotonin. Like I love going to them. That's pretty much it for this vlog. Sorry again that I didn't vlog that much in person i honestly just forgot that i was supposed to vlog and i feel like once you're at a concert you just kind of forget everything and it's just like very hectic um i'm gonna try my best to do better next time yeah i think that's it thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to follow me on my social media i posted a lot on there about p1 harmony and like pictures videos and all of that stay safe you guys and i'll see you guys in my next video okay bye